Hello everyone, in this video, we're gonna learn how to solve this German Kings trigonometric intro from the 2024 India Cheese events. Alright, so the key information in this problem is we're gonna use King's rule. Alright, so most of the advanced trigonometric intros, we're gonna use King's rule to solve it. Intro from A to B of F of S D S is equals in row from a to b of f of a plus b minus s ds all right so we're gonna let t equals pi over 2 minus s so we have v t equals negative ds right now s equals 0 t equals pi over 2 s equals pi over 2 t equals 0 right now i'm gonna call this one i so i have i equals intro from pi over 2 to 0 sine square of pi over 2 minus t right over 1 plus sine pi over 2 minus t cosine pi over 2 minus t right dt and I put the negative side in the front right now this guy turns out to be integral from 0 to pi over 2 right because I have the negative side over here so I just switch the paths right and then this guy becomes positive right now sine square of pi over 2 minus t turns out to be cosine square of t over 1 plus cosine cosine t right times sine t dt right now the variables right here agrees, right? So I just switch this one to S, right? So this one is the same thing as, and this guy actually I, right? Now I just saw that I equals this one, right? So I'm gonna add this one up vertically. So I have two I equals the integral from zero to pi over two. Right, this guy and this guy have the same denominator, right? So I just rewrite the denominator. Now the top side square of x plus cosine square of x is going to be 1, right? Now we know that sine 2s equals 2 sine s cosine s, right? So I'm going to divide both sides by 2. And then this one, this one tends to allow, right? Now I'm going to substitute side 2s over 2 for side s cos s in this integral right so i have now i'm going to multiply the top and bottom by 2 so i'm going to have 2i equals now i just change the variable what if i let t equals tangent s right i use double formula right here and then i have side 2s equals 2 t over 1 plus t square right remember that this angle right here double this one right and then we can apply the formula right here this guy right here must be double this guy right so then i just replace t with tangent s so this guy turns out to be 2 tangent s over 1 plus tangent square of s, right? So this one turns out to be 2i equals integral from 0 to pi over 2, right? 2 over 2 plus 2 tangent s over 1 plus tangent s square, right? ds now first i need to divide both sides by 2 so this one cancel out 
this one becomes 1, right? Next, I'm going to multiply the top bottom by 1 plus tangent square of s, right? So this one, 1 plus tangent square of s. This guy, 1 plus tangent square of s, right? So this one and this one cancel out, right? Now, I have i equals integral from 0 to pi over 2. Distribute this guy over here. So, I have 1 plus tangent square of s over 2 times 1 plus tangent square of s, right? Plus 2 tangent s ds, right? Now, this guy turns out to be The bottom right here, I factor 2 out, so I multiply both sides by 2. I have 2i equals integral from 0 to pi over 2. 1 plus tangent square of s, I just use the formula. It's going to be secant square of s ds, right? The bottom right here turns out to be tangent square of s plus tangent s plus 1, right? Now, let's use u substitution. So, I'm going to let u equals tangent s. Then, du equals secant square of s ds, right? Now, I'm going to change the bounds, right? The upper bound is going to be s equals pi over 2. Then, u equals tangent of pi over 2 is undefined, right? So, it could be infinity, right? Now, S equals 0, then U equals tangent of 0 equals 0, right? So I substitute back over here, so I have 2i equals integral from 0 to infinity du over u square plus u plus 1, right? Now, I'm going to use the complete square formula to solve this problem, right? Before I'm going to do that, I need to rewrite 2i equals, because this one is improper integral, right? So, I need to convert it to limit. So, I have 2i equals limit of the integral from 0 to b, du over u square plus u plus 1 when b approaches infinity, right? Now, to do this one, I need to use complete square formula, right? So, this guy turns out to be limit when b approaches infinity in the row from 0 to b du over u plus 1 half huh? square plus root 3 over 2 all together square, right? Basically, you just check the middle term right here, you divide by 2, 1 divided by 2, and square, and you add and subtract 1, 4, right? Now, we have the formula, the anti-derivative of d used over u square plus a square equals 1 over a tangent inverse of u over a plus c, right? Now, in this situation, u, which means the whole thing right here, right? This one is a, right? Then, we have 2i equals limit when b approaches infinitive. Now, take anti-derivative of this one. It turns out to be 1 over root 3 over 2, right? Tangent inverse of u plus 1 half over root 3 over 2, right? Then, evaluate this one from 0 to b, right? Now, we substitute this guy into this expression, so we have limit 
when b approaches infinity this guy turns out to be 2 over root 3 right now tension inverse r b subsidy over here is gonna be b plus 1 half root 3 over 2 turns out to be 2 over root 3 right so I multiply this one by 2 over root 3 subtract tangent inverse of 1 half over root 3 over 2 right now this guy becomes 2i equals 2 over root 3 now limit of the first one right here when b approaches infinity tension inverse of this one approaches tension inverse of infinity which is pi over 2 right so i have pi over 2 for this guy now second one tension inverse of this one is gonna be i multiply the top bottom by 2 so i have tension inverse of 1 over root 3 right and it's going to be pi over 6, right? So I subtract pi over 6, right? Now I'm going to divide both sides by 2. So I equals 1 over root 3 times pi over 2 minus pi over 6. Now this guy becomes 1 over root 3 times 2 pi over 6, right? 2 and 6 cancel out, so I have 3 on the bottom, right? So the answer should be pi over 3 root 3, right? And this is the final answer. And it's good time to stop. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember that if you fail failing to prepare, you're repairing to fail. Buildings as the chemicals they take us higher.